This is one of the best books I've read in a very long time. Full of adventure, full of sharks and scary stuff. And it's a true story. And it's a true story. I forgot to shave. Doesn't matter. Ken's here. We're going on a, well, it's not even really a hike. We're not going on a hike today, but we are going on a hike. We're going someplace super, super cool. Ken's never been there. He doesn't even know where we're going. But Kathy knows. Don't you, Kathy? I do. <laughs> uh, if you had to guess. Hmm. Somewhere near the ocean? Somewhere near... No. We're already there. Oh. Yeah. first before we go on this massive ordeal. It's not really massive, but uh, Ken doesn't know what it is. It's very, very exciting. It's going to be cool. It's a calibration. We're going action. out to Hogwood Bulsay. And uh, this is a place where they have filmed hundreds of, uh, of, of TV shows. Oh, uh, maybe not hundreds, maybe a hundred TV shows. And easily 50 to 100 movies. All of Ken's favorite. But if I said one of them, he would know exactly where we're going. I still understand. Water, milk. Milk, water? I'll, I'll go Dulce. Uh, Dulce is not milk, that's leche. Where I come from this time. <laughs> <laughs> they they filmed kung fu out here. Which one? Uh, well, you know which one? How many? There's tons of kung fu. No, there's only one one that matters. The one with David Carradine. Oh, that kung fu. Yeah, that kung fu. They they filmed uh, Gunsmoke. Okay. Uh, they filmed um, one of Kathy's movies. Kathy, which movie? Metal Storm. Kathy did the costume design for a movie called Metal Storm, The Destruction of Jared Sin. They were out there for about a week filming, so uh, Kathy might remember some of those things, even though it's been about a hundred years since she's been out there. At least. There may be some artifacts out there. <laughs> there's some leftover artifacts. <laughs> uh, but there's one show in particular that they filmed out there quite frequently, and it became a very, very famous uh, series of episodes. And as a result, uh, that's what put this place on the map. Well, what's, what? Is it Bonanza? Uh, no, they did film Bonanza out there, too. I'm thinking MASH. Uh, they didn't film MASH out there. They filmed MASH at the um, uh, the Malibu Creek State Park, which we've been to. That's that another vlog. Yeah, that was another vlog. That was really cool. Uh, but this one, this one's kind of a big deal because it's, it's very unique looking, very different, and uh, Ken's going to love it. get nervous, do you? With all the right cards in your hands I'm breathing just to feel my body You're screaming just to say you're sorry When it don't turn out the way you planned Are you ready? I'm giving it away. Here comes the answer. We're going to Vasquez Rocks. You've arrived at your destination. Do you know what that is? That's Vasquez Rocks. What is Vasquez Rocks? How do you get your name and left named after a rock? Dun 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 Cause it works whenever I stay Is there another way? But it works even more when I go You gotta let me know Yeah, it works whenever so we're at Vasquez Rocks, just arrived. Uh, there's a visitor center, looks like maybe a museum right here. We're gonna go check that out first. And we're gonna hike out. I spent this morning uh, getting some photos from the TV show Star Trek, where they shot out here quite a lot. And we're gonna try to recreate some of those scenes. Look at this dirt lounger. That's a, that's a dirt lounger. <laughs> Saw it in the evening, and then you 
said without a warning That you need someone to believe in Cause it hurts whenever I stay out here. I hope you guys can hear this. I feel like I just walked onto the planet Vulcan. It's not love, it's a trap we've fallen. Just like the war we fought in. Not love, it's a trap we've fallen. Cause it hurts whenever I stay. We're on the hunt, looking for locations. I don't know where they shot any of this one. Candy doesn't recognize anything either. It does remind me of an episode of Lone Ranger. <laughs> the Lone Ranger did definitely come through here. When the time is right and I'm not alone Way up the rock, and Kathy's freaking. I am not. She just said, Holy sh. When this world has stopped and the breeze is served, when the time is right, I'll sing you a song. Really cool place to have lunch uh, and look at this view that we have. Look at that view. <laughs> We're at pretty much the top. We could go higher. Kathy wants to go higher. She's a badass. But uh, check out this view from here. What? side and got that last shot. We're on the hunt for another location.
quick bathroom break. This is the porta potty. It actually doesn't smell that bad. Three epic locations so far. There's not much left. I mean, I don't know what uh, where they filmed Lassie or Gunsmoke or uh, Blazing Saddles, but it was all up in there. This is where we had lunch, right there. That was freaking awesome. What a great time. Uh, if you have never been to Vasquez Rocks, uh, it's in Agua Dulce. It's uh, on the, off the 14 freeway. An amazing place. Uh, it's kind of shocking, actually, how many TV shows and movies have been filmed in that location, almost to the point where it's they've vasquez themselves. So pretty much any time you see a, a show, a new show that shoots out there, you, you kind of know that's where it is. And then thoughts harken back to, um, you know, a Star Trek episode. But it doesn't really matter. It's really cool. Uh, we're going to be doing a lot more episodes like this. I mean, LA is filled with an amazing amount of, uh, of unique locations. And we're going to show you guys that. That's what we do here on the vlog. But if you, if you have an idea of something that you would like us to do, something that you'd like to see, something that you think is cool, maybe it's a location, uh, you know, somewhere in LA, or a movie that you that you enjoy and you want to see what that location looks like now, or some obscure movie car, you know, we'll find it. We'll find it. We'll show it to you. We'll drive it. We'll uh, experience it in some capacity. You know, uh, we're fueled by you guys, so uh, we need input from you guys, and and uh, and that always helps. As a side note, uh, we are driving currently this week the Hyundai Elantra Eco. Uh, I'm going to be doing a little bit more of that uh, of that car uh, coming up in a, in a couple of days. But tomorrow, tomorrow, I'm going to be joining uh, my friend Michael Axon. We're going to be grabbing a couple of his cars, a couple of exotics, and we're going to be going to the uh, the Sunset Gran Turismo, the Sunset GT show. It's a Cars and Coffee. It's over in kind of in the Hollywood area. It's gonna be super early. I hope you guys are up. As usual, hanging out with Michael. I, I don't know what it is that I'm gonna drive, but he's got about 20 cars, so we'll pick something something interesting. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed today's episode. We certainly had a good time doing it. As they say in Star Trek, live long and prosper. We'll see you tomorrow.